So apparently every January we're going to have a new type of war film. I mean, last year we had Lone Survivor and now this year we're having American Sniper. Let's see how this movie is. American Sniper. So American Sniper is a new war film that's starring Bradley Cooper and is directed by Clint Eastwood and essentially what it is is based on the true story of Chris Kyle who was known as the US military's most deadliest sniper. So what did I think of the movie? I actually thought it was pretty damn good. First, let me just say about American Sniper, it's actually really dark, it's really gritty. There are some moments that if you cannot handle like people getting shot in the face and children just getting screwed onto their legs, then you may want to stay away from this movie because there's some violent visuals in this movie because it's real. That's what I like about this movie. It felt real, it felt raw. And so I was like, okay, I actually feel like I'm watching a war film. And the shootout scenes in the movie are really cool. There's some in Hence moments, like from the scene of the trailer. And Bradley Cooper did a good job. You really are with him throughout this entire movie because he is the man. He is the guy that you see from the beginning to end. And Bradley Cooper did a really great job at it. Now, this movie has its problems. Yeah, I mean, the movie's two hours and 14 minutes and I thought there were some scenes that didn't really need to be in that movie because essentially this movie is about the life of Chris Kyle and how he went from as a child to become the most deadly sniper in US military history. There were some scenes that I was like, okay, that doesn't really go well with the story and it's not really necessary for you to have that in the film. So, there were some scenes I was like, ah, you could have cut that out and some scenes felt like they were dragging on. It's just little nitpicks here and there. But I just gotta say, overall, the film is a really, really good war film. Does it rank among the best of war films? Not necessarily. Does Bradley Cooper give a really great performance? Hell yeah, he does. And what I really like about this movie is it shows how much war can affect a person because you see Chris Kyle going through all these problems, all these traumas because once he comes back from war, he is not the same guy. War changes people and I really like how the film portrayed that because you know, you see a lot of things, you are in a different environment, you're constantly looking over your shoulder, and I love how the film portrayed that. Once he got back home, he still has that mentality, and I really love how the film dealt with that situation. And I'm going to give American Sniper, boom, a B plus. It is a really good war film. Don't worry about the controversy, just go and see the film, because trust me, it's pretty damn good. So guys, that's my review for American Sniper. What did you guys think of it? Did you think it portrayed the life of Chris Kyle good? Or did you think it did not do so much of a good job? Tell me what you guys think below. Thank you guys so much for watching my video. And as always, ladies and gentlemen, have a nice day.